Hey guys, Pyro here. Welcome back to another Helldivers 2 video. Today's video, I got some brand new clan news to go over. And it's getting crazy out here. So first up, according to this leak, as you guys can see on screen right now, it says Paloon orders are available to all members as long as they stay. Station is in the search platoon members, I think Orbit it says, are local to the planet. That means that the clan system is going to be linked to a space station. So if you guys ever played Halo 5, if you ever played Warframe, you have clan dojos that rotate around the solar system, Link right? to it and whatnot. Now I think the clan system should work similar to this. As you level up your clan, you're going to unlock rewards. I'm using Destiny 2 as an example. On here, you unlock engrams to give you emotes, cosmetic rewards, sometimes weapons, and other cool things. For Helldivers, it'd be cool if they gave you samples, super credits, some the R currency. And then for the bounty part of it, it'd be cool if you had the weekly bounties, some daily bounties, maybe some clan tied in bounties, even some bounties or quests tied to the main story would be pretty cool. <laughs> and like I said, they should reward super samples, rare samples in common based off difficulty, maybe sometimes give super credits too. I know in D2 on some of the quests you can do, you have a chance to get bright dust. So according to this, like it said, if the space station is locally close to set planet, it's you're going to have clan missions, bounties, and stuff to be able to do those on those planet. I'm guessing that it's going to reward you XP. It doesn't show too much about like if it's going to get samples or super credits for doing it. It just says XP. I know some games, by doing challenges, you get the currency rewarded to you. But uh, yeah, let's move on to the next part of this because there's some more juicy information here. So according to this other image right here I have on the screen, it's from Reddit, it was leaked. It shows post kick from clans, so you're allowed to kick people from the clans, that's pretty good to know. Um, it also says right here, they have clan invites, there's also a clan, clan member rank, so it's going to have a ranking system. So I'm guessing, I'm not sure if each ranks are going to be tied to what level you are in the game, or you have to do certain challenges and you slowly rank up. I know Destiny 2 implemented something similar recently to their game, to where you have to do different set challenges and it slowly ranks up your Guardian rank from like 1 through 10 or whatever. <laughs> you have experience, veteran, and then it goes etc, etc. Aside from that, we also have clan station info info so there's going to be a, so a station that's going to probably gonna have to go to for it we also have the clan level sec and specs so i'm guessing as you level up you can spec your level and stuff i guess it's kind of hard to understand that and then it says get clan level rewards now this is what i'm talking about right here now guys we have clan rewards now, last couple minutes of this video, I talked about how there was clan bounties and challenges, it was saying. So now we have clan rewards. So I'm guessing it's going to be very similar to Destiny 2's clan system. You do bounties and challenges, they reward your rewards, such as XP, sometimes the currency in the game. For Hell Divers, it'd probably be the sample of the R currency, maybe some super credits. Um, and as you slowly level up, you're going to help level up your clan. Depending on how many members you have, there might be rewards for everybody. Every time the clan levels up, everybody gets a reward. It wouldn't be an engram, of course, because it's Helldivers 2. <laughs> it could be super credits, but the R currency. Could be some samples, who knows? It also did talk about, like I said, clan rewards. It could also mean there may be some armor, exclusive armor to the clan system that you have to level up your clan to a certain level to unlock and whatnot. Um, sea of Thieves recently introduced something similar to that on their game, to where you have to play the game as you slowly level up your own faction, you unlock new cosmetics. Some new titles, some new rewards, stuff like that. This is definitely heavily similar to that, it seems like. Mars, near Earth, Super Earth. That There's stuff to do with that and whatnot. They might add the clan system or the clan vendor guy on Mars. Possibly he could be also added to Super Earth. For some weird reason, every single day again in the game, is always like 200 people on Super Earth. Even though the tutorial is on Mars. I think it's a bug or a glitch to get there, I don't know. Um, I'm wondering if the vendor might be located on Super Earth, possibly. Or they might just double down and put him on Mars with the tutorial guy. It's all speculation, of course, but these leaks are definitely really interesting. Now, finally, for the last thing, it does say a few other things, too. Like, you can disband your clan, of course. It's saying 
It was going to show new clan, which is clan games found. I don't know what it means by clan games found. It might be meaning like what missions your clan frequently does. Maybe it tracks that stuff. I'm not 100% sure. Then another one says clan out experience. So I guess you level up. Gain XP for doing stuff with the clan, I'm guessing. And then it says leaderboards. So there's going to be a leaderboard system similar to Call of Duty. Similar to like Warframe and many other games. Where clans are going to be placed on the leaderboard depending on how high their scores are, how high they do. The only thing it hasn't mentioned in these leaks of how many people you can have in a clan. <laughs> now, I know in Destiny 2 you can have 100 people. Helldivers 2 is a 4 player PvE game. So, if my brain's thinking about this right, they might have an 8 player clan possibly. Which is pretty much 2 squads of people. They might double down and make it 10 to maybe 20. <laughs> I don't see them making their clan 100 people. Because most of their activities aren't really that big. It would make no sense whatsoever. But who knows? At the end of the day, this is all speculative leaks. If you guys can enjoy some of this information, like and subscribe. Pirate Play signing out, y'all. And peace. Keep on gaming for democracy.